I made it to Frisco, Texas. I viewed the house. That was about an hour away from where was my next destination was. So I did a digital check-in, but I'm a little bit early for check-in. So I think I'm going to try to maybe go to a restaurant and sit down and get some food while I wait. I have about an hour's time to kill. I'm just going to go to this little restaurant right here while I wait for my hotel. It looks like a bar and grill. Let's see what this is. Wild Pitch Sports Bar and Grill. Let's check it out and see. Let's see what it's all about. I don't like the atmosphere, so I'm going to try again. I think I might drive around here and see what else I see. A couple other restaurants over here. Might as well check it out. i got time to kill, right? This is what I do. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to eat there. Nope, nope, nope. This is more like it. A couple more choices. It is hot out here. The Pima Dave and Busters. Cheesecake Factory was way crowded. It was like an hour wait for just one person. And my phone's gonna die soon, so that wasn't working. So I'm just sipping on a glass of wine at um, Dave and Buster. And the Cheesecake Factory is next door. And so I went on my the app on their website and just ordered a to-go pickup. So it's so crowded. So it'll be done in about 25 minutes. And then I'll just walk over there, pick it up. And by that time, it'll be perfect. It'll be time for me to check into my hotel. I feel like I need a nap. I'm tired. My digital key just popped up so we we'll go check into my hotel, but um, yeah, I gotta definitely go through emails, I need to do some personal stuff too, I need to set some calendars and some reminders, I slipped on a deadline, a semi-deadline this week, and that's a no-go for me, like I feel like I pride myself on being on time, so I gotta make sure that never happens again, so I'm gonna spend some time setting some calendars and reminders, and uh, keeping my business organized. I would think I was stressed out this week. There was so much going on between house hunting. I was doing some YouTube learnings. I was getting ready for my road trip. And then my main job and then my side business slash company. So it's all good. It happens to the best of us. I'm here. Yes. I love these little rooms. Tree by Hilton is so cute. Time to relax and get some work done. Yay! I'm excited. I do enjoy being home, but I enjoy this traveling, this road tripping too. Keeps me alive. I didn't even show my outfit today. How dare I? I wore my cute little blue tie-dye bodycon dress. I had to put a little bit, a little stain underneath them, a little tighten the midsection, but working on it. Yeah, this lady complimented me, made me feel good. The lady at the, when I was looking at the house, and she goes, oh my God, your, your figure is, 
is the word she said. Mm, I interpret it as your figure was gorgeous, so hopefully that's what she was saying. Chocolate cheesecake. Yes, I love my cheat days. I love my cheat days. Um, I used to love the Godiva a lot more, but I noticed like the last time or two that I got it, it didn't give me the same like rush. I think because like how I switched over, I mostly eat like a ketogenic diet. And so, you know, I don't eat a lot of refined sugar and stuff. And then when I make my desserts, I usually use like a monk fruit sweetener, you know, vanilla, like a lot of other, a lot of other things. So I think I'm teaching myself to like the things that are better for me, but that still doesn't stop me from fulfilling the urge, you know? You can't just diet all the time. Like it's gotta be lifestyle. And so your body's not gonna regress by one day of just enjoying yourself. It's in a mode, so I think my body's accustomed to burning things off. I intermittent fast um, a fair amount of time, so I'm good. I don't feel guilty or anything. I feel like I work hard, I hustle, I have up days, down days, but I just pick up the ball and keep moving if I fall off the wagon. And every day is sort of different, which is good, and then every day is kind of still the same, which is good, because the consistency is what breeds results. Let Dana say it. But um, I feel good, and this actually tastes yummy. I started digging in, and I thought, I better take a picture and share what I'm eating. And it's, I'm kind of glad I'm going to go ahead and eat and get it out of the way. And then I can just kind of close my eating window. I think I'll be done after most of this, and then I'll probably have a couple bites of that cheesecake, and then I'll be done. Yeah, and then I'm going to lounge, watch a little bit of TV, and then get on my computer and knock out a couple of projects that are pending that I need to get on and also accomplish some personal goals, setting my calendars, reminders, getting up to speed, making sure I'm not missing any deadlines. Yeah, I gotta stay on point and not let things slip, but I also have to monitor my multitasking and make sure that I'm not um, overdoing it to the point that I'm forgetting things and feeling anxious. So yeah, this is the new me, man. It's a work in progress. I'm not where I wanna be, but I'm not where I used to be, and that's for sure.